Hi, we are making this quick and easy love heart square card. We will design the card in quicker design space. The tools used in this project are a scoring tool. Here I'm using Quicker Scoring Stylus and Quicker 0.4 black pen. Before starting the project, go to datphone.com to download this beautiful Flora form. The download link is in the description below. Install the font on your computer. You might need to restart Design Space app. Okay, let's make the card. Open a new project in Design Space. Go to the shapes and choose the square with round corners. I'm just gonna change it to this cute peach color so it looks nicer. Go to the top and change the square size to 5x5. Five five. This is finished size for the card. Go to the position and change both X and Y to 0. This will help to position elements later. The square is now right on the top. Right click and duplicate. Position the second square to 5 for X and 0 for Y. Next, create a love heart. The default size is 2 inches. It is the size we need. We will align the heart and the square. Select both elements. Click align on the top. Go to the last one, center. The love heart is right in the middle of the square. I'm going to put text on the top. So just gonna move the heart down a bit to make room. Hold the shift key on your keyboard when you're moving down the heart. This way is to ensure the heart is still aligned vertically centered with the square. Go to the tool panel and click text. Go to the form on the top, type in flora. And search. Choose Flora one. I'm gonna change it to my favorite word, love. Move to the top of the car. It is a bit small. Change the size to 4.5 inch width. They are still too close to the top. Hold the shift key and move the heart down a bit more. We can see the X value stays the same, only the Y value changes. Move love down as well. I want to make sure love is in the center. Select both love and the square. Go to align and choose center horizontally. Just gonna move it down a tad. The layout is done. We are going to cut the heart out of the square. Select the heart, right click and duplicate it. Now we are making the heart cut out. Select the square and the heart. Go to the right hand side button, click slice. The love word is invisible. It is still there, but it is behind the square. Leave it for now. We will remove the slide parts we don't need. Select the heart and delete. Also the heart underneath. When click on it, it is a square got selected. On the right hand side panel, the square is on the top layer. Click the heart on the right hand side panel to select it. Delete. We have made the heart cut out. Select both squares. Click weld at the bottom. Now the card is in one piece. We need a score line in the middle. Go to the shapes tool. Choose the line. The card is 5x5, five five, so the score line needs to be 5 inches high too. Change the height to 5. We want the score in the middle. Type in position value x5 and y0. Select the card and the line. Both are selected. Click Attach. Right click and choose send to back. Now we can see love again. Because the car is down so we can move it away from the very top, it is easier to see and work away from the corner. Choose love, go to the top and change it to pen. 
select the card and the text. Click Attach. We have done the design of the card. How easy is that? This love heart is the same size as the cut out, so it will be our reference. We are going to create a heart that is slightly bigger than this one. It will go to the inside of the card. Click the heart and go to the offset on the top. Make it 0.15 inch. And I like sharp corner. Click apply. A new heart has been created. Just gonna change it to red. Second heart will be pop out from the heart cutout. So the size need to be smaller than the reference cutout. Choose the reference heart and go to the offset. Set the distance to minus 0.15. Apply. A smaller black heart has been made. I will change it to the same color as the card. Use this heart to create the smallest heart. Same offset setting minus 0.15. Click Apply. Change it to red color. Now we have all the heart elements done. Remove the gray heart. We don't need it as it is the reference. Now the design is ready. Click Make it. The first page, it shows the order here, like QuickCut will score it first, pen draw second, and then cut last. Second page is just basic cut. Back to the first page, we know this heart is smaller than the cutout, so move it to save space. All set, click continue. Edit your scoring tool, I'm using QuickCut stylus. Install the stylus in clamp A. The score line is done now. There is a pop-up window to ask to load the pen in clamp A. No need to unload the cutting mat. Just take out the stylus, install the pen. Press the flashing button to continue. The card is done. It is looking good. Uninstall the pen and put the lid back on. Look at the details. It is amazing. Quick card draw so fine. All the elements are done. The assembly is very easy. For the score line in the middle, use a pencil to mark the heart. When open the card, it is where we stick the heart. Glue the biggest heart here. When close the card, we could see the lovely red color. Use dot forms for the remaining hearts and stack them together. How easy is this? This design can be used for so many occasions. Go to the right hand side panel and double click the text layer. Change the text to suit different needs. Changes to make a Mother's Day card or type in any words you prefer. After changing the text, it will become basic card setting. Deattach the whole thing. Just gonna move it over to make it center. Select the text and change it to pen. Select the whole card and click attach. Now we have another card. Save this template and it will be a wonderful last minute card making project. Hope you enjoy this project. Thank you for watching.